KFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrial trading down 225, NASDAQ off 106, S&P's down 32. Gold. Gold contract trading down $9.1816 an ounce. We have silver up $0.09, cents, $24.08 an ounce. Light sweet crude up $1.99, $77.38 a barrel. Notes and bonds. A 10-year note down two ticks trading in 114.23. The 30-year flat at 131.07 in King Dollar. King Dollar uh, trading down 230 ticks, 103.746. Euro is at 106, yen is at uh, 135, and the British pound is at trade at a price point of 124 to 1 US dollar. We had the, um, the Fed came out, Powell's talking right now, folks, uh, half a percent, that's what it come out as. If we take a look at this, what you, get, what you had, the thing that's amazing, man, is that, the, you know, the Fed's telling us this is going to be longer and higher for a lot longer, okay? Um, and the bottom line is that the market really doesn't care, man. <laughs> I mean, it's pretty, you know, we're down 30 bucks, but the market's really shaking it off. So right now, what we are is that we are at 4.25 to 4.5 on the top line, right? The Fed is saying that at the beginning of, um, well, at the end of uh, 2023, they're going to be at 5.1. The biggest thing that I've caught out of this, and, that, and this is what Powell keeps saying, folks, the bottom line, they're going to bring this down to 2%. Let me tell you something. Bringing this down to 2% is going to take a lot longer than a year or a year and a half. You're talking about two to three years of very high rates. And we'll see whether the market you know, gets used to high rates. This is where this is shaking out, though. That's the bottom line. So we'll see what happens when it gets off the air. But right now, what you have is that if we take a look at this S&P, you know, you had that failure yesterday in a monster way and now bottom line it's going to go for the other end of the consolidation you know the spies down three bucks bottom of this consolidation is 391 you're 398 the gap is still wide open at this uh, 381 we'll let's take a look at the ndx 100 same type of setup inside the ndx you get the Qs down 267 right excuse me folks right now uh bottom line is that the bottom of that consolidation is uh 279 or 286 and that gap there is a uh, at 268, and I expect we're going to go for that gap. We take a look at the gold contract. What do you have with the gold contract? Hanging tough. I mean, it's only down nine bucks. That's nothing. Because um, he had, you know, a nice day out here. But the bottom line is that, you know, uh, I suspect, you know, the dollar is down. Somehow this dollar wants to bounce. It's been fluctuating up and down a couple hundred ticks. We'll see what happens after he gets off uh, the air. Stay right there, folks. Come right back.